well, I'm Stephanie, and if you can't tell from my voice already, I've been sick for the past like week and a half. I'm usually never sick this long, but it's just been lingering. I think it's because I've had midterms and stuff, and I was just really ignoring the sickness and trying to get through it. And after midterms, I just crashed like for a few days. So I've been pretty down and out for the past few days, but. Something just lifted my spirits. I got my VIB sale order in from Sephora. I ordered a couple of things that I use all the time, but I also ordered some things that I've never even tried before and I just read reviews on. So I've had actually a couple of days to try out the items and I'm really actually satisfied with everything that I bought, which is fairly surprising. I ordered three of my Urban Decay 24-7 waterproof liquid eyeliners. Um, this is my holy grail eyeliner. I've never found one that I that can even compare to this one, so I'm just gonna keep using this until I find a cheaper alternative. But actually, two of these are for me, and one of them is gonna be put into a giveaway that I am doing probably within the next few weeks. I'm compiling some of my favorite things, and I'm gonna be doing my first giveaway. So keep an eye out for that. Then I ordered my Lancome Seals Boost XL Super Enhancing Mascara Base and this stuff is amazing. I have pretty short eyelashes and nothing spectacular but if you put this underneath any of your mascaras it'll just totally amplify, thicken, volumize, whatever. It'll just make your eyelashes look amazing so I really like this stuff. This stuff lasts for a really long time so well worth the money. Because I had 20% off, I finally bit the bullet and I ordered the Glam Glow Super Mud Clearing Treatment. And this is the box set that comes with the Youth Mud Tingle Exfoliant Treatment. I've gotten samples of this from Sephora maybe like two or three times. Totally guilty of that because it's so expensive, uh, but I really liked it. And the last time I went into Sephora, the girl that I spoke to at Sephora told me that they're not allowed to give out samples of this mask any longer because so many people were asking for samples that they were running out of the product. So I was just like, oh, okay, fine. I'm gonna just order it. And this mask is just the most satisfying mask when you really wanna clarify all the gunk out of your skin. When you put it on, it starts off as a dark gray color and it dries fairly quickly into a light gray, but you keep it on and in all the pores and where there's a lot of oils, you start seeing it turn dark gray again. Like it's sucking out all the oils from your pores. It's, it's a really disgusting and satisfying mask at the same time. If you want a mask that gives you instant gratification, this is a mask for you. And it leaves your skin feeling so good afterwards. You just feel really, really clean. And I've actually also gotten samples, like 100 point perks of the Youth Mud. And it really leaves your skin feeling very supple and nice so I'm looking forward to using both of these masks but I'm definitely going to ration them very carefully. There's a lot of hype around this next product that I ordered and it is the Makeup Forever Full Cover Waterproof Concealer and I'm usually never the kind of person who will order something like foundation or concealers online because I just want to see it in person but I thought you know VIB sales 20% off it, if it doesn't match me then I can go ahead and go to a Sephora and exchange it for the correct color but this turned out to be the correct color I think so I'm like pretty impressed with myself uh, this concealer is really nice I've actually been using my Kat Von D uh, foundation as my concealer and I think that it was breaking me out so I decided to do some research into another concealer and this one has so many positive reviews and I think it's really nice. It covers blemishes well. That is what I was looking for. Some concealers will actually make your blemishes stand out more. It just looks really cakey and this one doesn't do that. So I'm going to keep using it. I've only used it for maybe two or three times now, but I'm pretty satisfied with it so far and I'll let y'all know how I feel about it later on down the road. The next item I ordered is a foundation and it is the Hourglass Immaculate Liquid Powder Foundation. And I've heard a lot of good things about this foundation for people with oily skin, which I definitely have. Uh, it comes with a pump, 
out of the packaging, but I haven't put it in yet just in case the color wasn't right for me, but I actually think it matches my skin tone, which is also very pleasantly surprising. Uh, I've used this maybe three times now, and I think the issue right now is because I've been sick, uh, I'm getting some dry patches and stuff, so it definitely sticks to your dry patches. It really is um, a liquid to powder foundation. It gives you a really nice finish if you like that really matte finish but it has been sticking to my dry patches. So I'm gonna continue using this and once my skin kind of becomes more normal, uh, I'll let y'all know how this is working out for me. But so far, I'm actually really liking it even though it's sticking a bit. My last item that I actually bought is this awesome Sephora eyelash curler and it is like this oil slick eyelash curler. I thought I would finally upgrade my eyelash curler game so I went on to Sephora and I saw this one and I was like yes this is the one. It's pretty sick, pretty self-explanatory but I thought it was cool. Yeah that's all the items that I purchased from the VIB sale. Let me know if y'all participated in the VIB sale and what you bought. Um, any makeup items that you would like to recommend to me please keep it coming. I take all your suggestions and I roll with them, I like look them up and do a little research, so I love hearing what y'all are into. So yeah, I apologize if I'm like, well, I feel like I'm pretty out of it in this video, but <laughs> yeah. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. You can find me on Instagram at Soothing Sista and all my other social media will be in the down bar below. Please leave a comment if you would like to, and I hope to see y'all very soon. Bye!